Welcome to Writer's ER, where we unravel the mysteries of academic writing and guide you through the labyrinth of dissertation and thesis research. Today we dive into a topic that resonates deeply with every academic writer, battling the inner critic that whispers, my writing stinks, during the drafting process. It's a journey through mindfulness tailored specifically for you, the scholars, the thinkers, and the dreamers, embarking on the rigorous path of doctoral and PhD programs. Picture this, you're seated before your computer, the cursor blinking mockingly on a blank document, and there it is, that nagging voice telling you your ideas aren't good enough, your words are clumsy, and your arguments are weak. It's a scenario all too familiar, isn't it? But what if I told you that there's a way to silence that inner critic, to transform those moments of doubt into opportunities for growth and creativity? Mindfulness, a practice rooted in being present and fully engaged with the here and now, without judgment, offers a powerful tool for academics struggling with self-doubt. Let's explore practical strategies to employ mindfulness in your writing process, ensuring that you not only combat your inner critic, but also enhance the quality and productivity of your work. First, let's talk about recognizing the inner critic. This voice often stems from our deepest fears and insecurities about not being good enough. Acknowledge its presence, but don't let it take the driver's seat. Instead, gently remind yourself that writing is a process, one that inherently involves revising and improving. Your first draft is not your final draft, and every writer, no matter how experienced, goes through this. Next, introduce the practice of mindfulness breathing before writing sessions. Take a moment to breathe deeply, focusing solely on your breath. This simple act can center your thoughts, reduce anxiety, and create a clear space for your ideas to flow. It's about resetting your mental state to one of calm and focus, where creativity can thrive. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Writer's ER for more insights, tips, and strategies to aid your academic writing journey. Incorporating mindfulness into your writing means being present with your thoughts and ideas without judgment. When you find yourself critiquing your work harshly, pause. Reflect on why you're feeling this way. Is it fear of failure or perhaps perfectionism? By understanding the root of these thoughts, you can address them more constructively. Set small achievable goals for your writing sessions. This approach can help shift your focus from the overwhelming task of completing an entire dissertation to the accomplishment of writing a few hundred words or outlining a chapter. Celebrating these small victories can boost your confidence and silence the inner critic. Remember, your writing doesn't have to be perfect on the first try. Embrace the messiness of the drafting process. Allow yourself to write poorly, to make mistakes, because it's through these mistakes that we learn and grow. The delete key is there for a reason. Use it, but only after you've given your thoughts the freedom to unfold on the page. Journaling can also be a powerful mindfulness practice. Dedicate a few minutes each day to write about your thoughts, fears, and achievements related to your academic journey. This practice can offer insights into your writing habits and the recurring themes in your inner critic's narrative, enabling you to challenge and overcome them. Lastly, cultivate a community of support. Share your experiences with peers or mentors who understand the academic journey. Often you'll find that you're not alone in your struggles. This sense of camaraderie can be incredibly reassuring and diminish the power of your inner critic. As we wrap up, remember that writing is an act of courage. It's about putting your ideas out there, imperfect as they may be, and refining them through the lens of critical thought and creativity. Your inner critic, while challenging, doesn't define your potential or the value of your work. Through mindfulness, you can learn to navigate these internal battles with grace and emerge a more confident, productive writer. I encourage you to share in the comments what strategies have you found effective in silencing your inner critic. Let's learn from each other and build a supportive community of academic writers. And then halfway through your progress, remember to hit like, share, and subscribe again, ensuring you stay updated with our latest content designed to make your academic journey a little less daunting and a lot more successful. Thank you for joining me today. Keep writing, keep striving, and remember, every word you write is a step forward in your academic journey.